coming of a stalwart. Moses Mawane Kotane has been reunited with his people. Finally, closure and a sense of peace for the family. After 95 years of absence from his home village, this is where his parents and siblings are buried. Hence, we decided he belongs here. His, they say, was a life lived in selfless service of his people. Willingness in the process to even, for all practical purposes, uh, take the ultimate sacrifice, which for him meant sacrificing his family. And hope that Kotane's legacy will become a beacon for his people. Any memory must have a, a significance to this community. It must speak to the lives of this community. It must bring jobs to the community. Kotane, through his legacy, this community must benefit. His final resting place, just a few meters from his home, on land owned by the Moses Kotane Foundation. A monument has already been erected near his grave, which will form part of the legacy project. Kotani is survived by his 103-year-old wife, Rebecca, and three children. Solofelo Matibedi, SABC News, Pella, near Rustenburg.